Hi, I'm Catalina with Catblog, and I love Dayton, and I love showing off what I love about Dayton. And my question to you is, when it comes to doing Facebook Live and making little DIY videos, how do I go about that respectfully and legally for those businesses? Yeah. So what are you actually doing? Are you actually going out? I would, I would love to go to a business and be like, hey, I'm here at my favorite you know, coffee shop, and look how cool it is, and look how cool the baristas mm -hmm. are, and that kind of thing. Is uh, to me, I would ask for permission, uh, because you want to get the person engaged. businesses to I actually go out to competing restaurants and do a show at their place to promote them because they're going to share my link they're very receptive to doing it okay. so uh, maybe we could do uh, a show together actually yes, absolutely yeah I'm I mean put that on my calendar yes okay <laughs> seriously okay thank you Hi, um, I do digital fundraising for Dayton Children's, and um, we do lots of Facebook ads, uh, campaigns for fundraising, and we've had really great success as far as impressions and engagement, but really low um, action as far as gifts made. So I was just wondering if you have any experience doing fundraisers um, through Facebook, and one of our issues is that our Facebook fundraisers are not set up yet. We had some banking issues, but we're working through it. So any other advice you might have as far as raising money through Facebook ads? Start. <laughs> I've got some in response to Okay, gotcha. Um, so where are you driving them to now? Are you driving them to children's donation page? To our website, page? yeah. Yep. yeah. Um, I would start with the lookalike list of people who've already donated to you. Because <laughs> you can hit the people who've donated up to you again, but build a lookalike from those, and then give them an incentive to donate now. What are you? A giveaway, a gift card, anything like that kind of helps as well if you're having a drawing later. Mm -hmm. um, all the same sort of things that you would do if you were doing like a location thing to get people to make sure they donate before they would physically leave the building. Mm -hmm. You just have a digital building. Okay. I, actually, I just got asked to do a, a Facebook Live at the Cha Cha event. I don't know if you're familiar with that. A lot of nonprofits. We've held a lot of fundraisers. Uh, it's been very hard to get people to physically donate online. Um, but what we're going to attempt to do with that is text to donate. Uh, we're going to push that more than physically getting someone to click uh, on a link and actually physically get their credit card out. So it's easier. So that's something we're testing. So Great. I'll probably let you know how it goes. But yeah. that's. Uh, I think that's the way, and it's going to be done through live, okay. so that way we can acknowledge people live, and people like that, that we're acknowledging them live for donating it, um, and bring in some other influencers that can acknowledge them, whether it's a musician or actor or whatever it may be, and that's what we're going to test. I love that idea. We should talk. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Thank you.